far as the yes and no answer. Ms. Mayor, would you advocate for the construction of and maintenance for the dog park, the swimming facility uh, for the dogs, of course. <laughs> A dog park with a dog park with a swimming facility. I tell you what, having been out every day that since uh, in this heat, when the heat index is over 105, it doesn't sound like a bad idea. We right now have a uh, a very nice dog park off of Spruce Street Road near Old Children's Park. Do something like that. Terrific idea. I wouldn't mind looking for some partnerships, public-private, to help pay for that. A lot of the improvements that we have at the dog park now were because of public-private partnerships. So, yeah, I think it would be uh, nice to be able to add something like that to our city. I, I think it's a, a great idea. Obviously, uh, some some analysis would have to be put into it. I know that our dog park now currently is, is a great asset to Port Orleans. It's used a lot. So, uh, would I be open to a new one with the pool? Absolutely. Obviously, we just need to look into all the, the locations and figures and, and how it's maintained. My friends, there you have it. There are people in government who believe government's job is to spend money. The punchline at the end of every council meeting is we are going to spend money. That's what it is. Absolutely not do we need a dog park with a dog swimming pool. Are you nuts? We all just stood up here a minute ago and, and expressed our, our, our fidelity with Republicanism, with lower government, with smaller government, lower taxes. And these guys want to have a dog park with a swimming pool. How about instructions at that dog park? What about we got a dog that can't swim? Do we have instructors for dogs so that they can learn how to swim? Where are we going to drop a line here, ladies and gentlemen? So no, absolutely not. Um, thank you. 